it's never too early to begin the care and cleaning of your baby's teeth. As Claudia Solisa Kala tells us, daily care should begin even before your baby's first tooth emerges. The first signs that your child is cutting his or her first pearly white can be quite noticeable. Amanda Pacheco says she's seen the signs with her seven-month-old daughter, Jordan. She's been drooling a lot more than normal and putting a lot of like her baby toys in her mouth, as well as her fingers, chewing on them a lot. While every child is different, primary or baby teeth generally begin to appear at six months. Babies are likely to become fussy. Dr. Rosaro Pacheco, a pediatric dentist in Fresno, says that's because teething can be irritating and painful. You'll start noticing that the, the two first, the two, the teeth that first erupt are the ones in the front. And um, they'll be a little red and tender. Um, your child may start drooling a, quite a bit. They'll be a little more cranky and fussy. There is no set oh. pattern on when teething will begin, how long it will take, or how painful it will be. So it's good for parents to know the best way to ease that pain. Dr. Pacheco recommends that you gently massage the gums with a clean finger. Initially, just start off a little a tender massaging because what you're helping them, what, what you're doing is you're helping the teeth break through the gums. So if you just gently massage and massage them, they'll, they'll, it'll ease the, the tissue to, so the teeth can pop through. I'll just kind of rub them just because I've heard that helps soothe the pain and, um, or give her something cool to chew on, like a teething ring or something. Whatever you give your child to chew on, make sure it isn't a choking hazard. Dr. Pacheco also advises against using numbing ointments. And um, the, the babies are going to swallow that and then numb the back of their throat. So that creates a choking hazard. So I, I don't recommend that. Your child should begin regular dental checkups after that first tooth appears, but no later than his or her first birthday. We're looking at the development of the, the teeth and the gums and making sure we don't see any problems. And it's also a chance so that we can talk to the parents, the caregiver, and then um, give them um, um, preventive information to avoid dental caries. Babies can get cavities too. Even though the first set of teeth will fall out, tooth decay can leave gaps before the permanent teeth are ready to come in. An important step in preventing tooth decay have your baby finish their bedtime or nap time bottle before they fall asleep. Baby bottle tooth decay is a very uh, severe and painful form of dental caries. And it's caused by frequent and long exposures of the baby's teeth to liquids that have sugar. And among those liquids are um, of your regular milk, including breast milk, formula, fruit juices, even diluted fruit juices, and anything, um, um, any, any type of sweetened liquid that stays on the teeth too long. Begin cleaning your baby's mouth during the first few days after birth. Wipe your baby's gums after each feeding with a clean, damp washcloth to remove the residual food. She tries to chew my finger, but no, it doesn't bother her. I mean, maybe the holding still part is a little hard, but other than that, it's not anything. As soon as the first tooth appears, Brush the tooth and gums with a soft bristled toothbrush and a little bit of water. Toothpaste is not recommended until a child reaches age two. At that time, supervise brushing to ensure that your child does not swallow the toothpaste. Thanks, Claudia. And for more information on oral hygiene for babies, just go to kbpt.org and click on 0 to 5 in 30 minutes. To contact Fresno Pediatric Dentist, Dr. Rosa Ra Pacheco, call 298-9690. This program funded in part by First Five Fresno County. At First Five, we focus on the first five years of life. We fund programs and services that better the lives of children in Fresno County.
Additional funding from First 5 Tulare County. Changing lives and building futures. Because it's all about the kids. And First 5 Madera County. Strengthening communities through the Family Resource Centers. Where it's all about the kids. <laughs>